I try to show him the best that I can what I want, and when he comes closer, when he does it right, I reward him with food and play. Those are his two like best things, and as you can see, he, he kind of gets it. When, he, when I say place now, he'll, he'll go to his little pillow, and if I say break, good boy, you can break. You can break, you can come here. You good boy, come here. Little monster is really, really quick to learn, so I, I know I'm a little bit lucky with that. Um, and he's teeny tiny, so it's easy to kind of manipulate him how I want. Uh, that being said, he's also um, he's also just any other dog, right? So I think that positive reinforcement really helps with him. Good little boy. Because of that, he's got probably 15 different, 15 or 16 different tricks that he knows and that he knows well. Um, and it really only takes a couple of days for a trick to become like a new normal for him. Like this one, I'll, I'll practice it again tomorrow and the next day. With all of his regulars, I'll, I'll put it into the um, the rotation with all of his regular tricks. We're working on um, Thunder and I are getting it to be a little bit stronger in front of people. He's a little bit shy, so he gets over overwhelmed and overexcited. So he starts breathing heavy and he he doesn't do the right trick. So I want to get him to be a little bit more uh, confident and collected when he's in front of groups. When it's just him and I, he's he's awesome. He's awesome and he's really obedient and he, he tries his best. He does get overwhelmed sometimes, but he tries his best to do uh, what I want. Don't ya? Can I have a kiss? Can I have a kiss? <laughs> Thank you. So let me know in the comments below what tricks you think I should teach him and if I missed any. And let me know if you want me to show you how I taught him different tricks because all of them were managed in probably one afternoon. On the, for the most part, and uh, yeah, so I'd be happy to show. Okay, so um, today I'm gonna go through his tricks again and see if we can brush him up on his new trick that he learned last night. And go place. So that's his new trick. He's um, he's obviously not 100% clear on it yet, but he's gonna get it. He's gonna get it so good, huh? This. Nope. Okay, so basically the second part of that trick is that he holds it until I say break. So, kind of got it, huh? Place. Bless you. Lie down. Break. Good stuff, buddy. You're getting it so good. Place. Thank you. Can I have your paw? Thank you. Place. Place. <laughs> good boy. Good boy, high five. You're doing such a good job, huh? Oh, thank you. Place. Understand. I've got purple pillow, gray mat. Place. Nope. Place. Place. Under place. Yep. Good boy. Place. Lie down. Lie down. Lie down. Good boy. 
break? Yes. No, no, over there. Place the purple one. Place over there. You don't get it, huh? Place. 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 Fly down. What I want to be working on next is being able to kind of ignore him while he is in place and have him stay there and kind of chill out. So that's why I'm talking to the camera now while he's stuck there. Break! Good boy! Not so much a trick as it is a command. I want him to be able to uh, know what I want. Like if people are coming over or maybe if the door gets knocked on, instead of him barking, if I tell him to go to his place, I want to be able to kind of use that and, uh, and get him a little bit more in tune with what I want. Break! Good boy! Good boy, Thunder! He is understanding that when I'm talking, uh, it's not necessarily to him, but if you kind of, if you watch him, something that we worked on and that probably took the longest amount of time right when I got him was uh, eye contact. So instead of, there's a whole pile of treats right here, and you see him look at them, but he knows he's not supposed to touch them, and look, immediately he goes right back up to my eyes. So he'll look at my hands because I was just petting him, but then he'll go right up to my eyes. And you can see when I ask him to do that, he's looking at my eyeballs right now, he's not looking at my hand. If I move my hand, you can see his eyes go down, but then he comes right back up to my eyes because he's such a good boy. Good boy, Brick! Good boy! So that time I did it without hands, which is awesome.